Are you ready to discover the beauty of Egypt? Let me take you on a journey through ancient history, to a time when pharaohs ruled the country and Egyptian gods each had their very own temple. In this video, I will show you the most magical places that showcase the true beauty of Egypt, including some insider tips on how to get to them and where to go to avoid the crowds. All of the places will be linked to a Google Maps location. Number one is outrageous, so watch till the end to find out. Today, I am going to show you top 10 most beautiful places in Egypt. Before the video begins, please give it a like, and if you want to see more, please subscribe to the channel and let us know in the comments which country you want to see next. Now let's begin. 10. Egyptian Museum A treasure trove of the pharaonic world. Cairo's Egyptian Museum is one of the world's great museum collections. The faded pink mansion in downtown Cairo is home to a dazzling amount of exhibits. It's a higgledy-piggledy place with little labeling on offer and chronological order severely lacking. Instead, every corner you turn here is home to some wonderful piece of ancient art or statuary, which would be the highlight of any other museum. The museum's star collection is the Hall of Golden Treasures unearthed from Tutankhamun's tomb in the Valley of the Kings. 9. Saqqara Everyone's heard of Giza's pyramids, but they're not the only pyramids Egypt has up its sleeve. Day-tripping distance from Cairo, Saqqara is a vast necropolis of tombs and pyramids that was utilized during every era of pharaonic rule. It's best known for its Old Kingdom Step Pyramid, which shows how the architects of ancient Egypt advanced their engineering knowledge to finally create a true pyramid shape. There's much more to see beyond the Step Pyramid, though, with some of the surrounding tombs, such as the Mastaba of T, showcasing some of the finest tomb paintings you'll see in the country. Nearby, the Pyramid of Dashur is home to the Red Pyramid and Bent Pyramid, which should be included on any Saqqara visit. 8. South Sinai's Beach Life Egypt's South Sinai region on the Sinai Peninsula offers a beach for every type of traveler. Sharm el-Sheikh is a European-style resort town packed full of luxury hotels, international restaurants, and bags of entertainment options. A favorite of Europeans on winter sun vacations, many of the resorts here cater to families on one- to two-week sun and sand breaks. Dahab is a low-key beach town with a budget traveler heart, which is just as much about desert excursions and adventures as the sea. It's particularly known for its cheap dive package deals and for its lagoon beach area where windsurfing and kite surfing are the top activity. Up the coast, between the port town of Nuiba and the border town of Taba, are the bamboo hut retreats that offer complete getaway from it all respites from life and back to basics beach life. 7. Explore Islamic Cairo The atmospheric narrow lanes of the capital's Islamic Cairo district are crammed full of mosques, madrasas, Islamic schools for learning, and monuments dating from the Fatimid through to the Mamluk eras. This is where you'll find the labyrinth shopping souk of Khan el Khalili, where coppersmiths and artisans still have their tiny workshops, and stalls are laden with ceramics, textiles, spice, and perfume. Surrounding the market is a muddle of roads, home to some of the most beautiful preserved architecture of the old Islamic empires. 6. Diving the Red Sea the coral reefs of the Red Sea are renowned among scuba divers for both the soft corals on display and the vast amount of sea life, from colorful reef fish and nudibranchs to sharks, dolphins, turtles, rays, and even dugongs. For divers, the most famous town to base yourself in is Sharm el-Sheikh on the Sinai Peninsula, closest to the reefs of Ras Mohammed National Park, as well as the reefs of the Straits of Tehran. To dive the sites of the Straits of Gubal, head to Hergada, or El Gauna, on the Red Sea coast while advanced divers should check out the resort of Marsa Alam, the nearest base for diving Egypt's deep south dive sites. 5. Abu Simbel Even in a country festooned with temples, Abu Simbel is something special. This is Ramses II's great temple, adorned with colossal statuary standing guard outside and with an interior sumptuously decorated with wall paintings. Justly famous for its megalithic proportions, Abu Simbel is also known for the incredible engineering feat carried out by UNESCO in the 1960s, which saw the entire temple moved from its original setting to save it from disappearing under the rising water of the Aswan Dam. Today, exploring Abu Simbel is just as much about admiring the triumph of this international effort to save the temple complex as it is about gaping in wonder at Ramses II's awe-inspiring building works itself. 4. Aswan 
Egypt's most tranquil town is Aswan, set upon the winding curves of the Nile. Backed by orange-hued dunes, this is the perfect place to stop and unwind for a few days and soak up the chilled-out atmosphere. Take the river ferry across to Elephantine Island and stroll the colorful streets of the Nubian villages. Then ride a camel to the desert monastery of St. Simeon on Aswan's east bank. Afterwards, relax in one of the riverboat restaurants while watching the Latine-sailed feluccas drift past. Make sure to jump aboard a felucca at sunset to sail around Aswan's islands. This is by far Aswan's most popular activity and the most relaxing way to take in the local sights. There are plenty of historic sites here and numerous temples nearby, including Philae Temple on its island. But one of Aswan's most popular things to do is simply kicking back and watching the river life go by. 3. Cruising the Nile Egypt is defined by the Nile. For many visitors, a multi-day cruise upon this famed waterway that saw the rise of the pharaonic era is a highlight of their Egypt trip. Cruising the Nile is also the most relaxing way to see the temples that stud the banks of the river on the route between Luxor and Aswan, plus sunrise and sunset over the date palm-studded riverbanks, backed by sand dunes, is one of Egypt's most tranquil vistas. The two famous sites on the Nile cruise are the Temple of Kam Ambo and Edfu's Temple of Horus, where all the big cruise boats stop. 2. Luxor's Temple and Tombs Famed for the Valley of the Kings, Karnak Temple, and the Memorial Temple of Hachput, the Nile side town of Luxor in Upper Egypt has a glut of tourist attractions. This is ancient Thebes, power base of the New Kingdom pharaohs and home to more sites than most can see on one visit. Luxor's east bank is home to the modern city, with its vibrant suit, the two temples of Karnak and Luxor, and the museum. The West Bank's lush farmland and barren cliffs are where the vast majority of Luxor's tourist attractions sit, with so many tomb and temple sites that it has been called the biggest open-air museum in the world. Spend a few days here exploring the colorful wall art of the tombs and gazing in awe at the colossal columns in the temples, and you'll see why Luxor continues to fascinate historians and archaeologists. 1. Pyramids of Giza the last surviving wonder of the seven wonders of the ancient world, the Pyramids of Giza are one of the world's most recognizable landmarks. Having awed travelers down through the ages, these tombs of the pharaohs Cheops, Khufu, Sephrin, Khafra, and Mycerinus, Menkaur, guarded by the enigmatic Sphinx, are usually top of most visitors' lists of tourist attractions to see in Egypt, and often the first site they head to after landing. Today, sitting on the desert edge of Cairo sprawl, these megalithic memorials to dead pharaohs are still as wondrous a sight as they ever were and an undeniable highlight of any Egypt trip. Thank you for watching and please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and enable post alerts to view more of our future videos. After saying that, keep watching our videos and I'll speak with you in the next one.